Eh, ¿Qué onda? Soy que le seguimos jugando WWE 2K15. Ahora sí me salió la primera. Y vamos a ver cómo Michael detiene su... Su cinturo, ¿no? Que le acaba de ganar a Triple H en la cámara de la eliminación. Enfrentándose a Rob Van Damme. Vamos a verlo. Toco, toco, ton, toco, toco, ton. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. Rob Van Dam has come close to becoming World Heavyweight Champion on a couple of occasions, but he never got it done. One time thanks to Ric Flair and a sledgehammer. I remember that vividly. Uh, close, but no cigar, Cole. But I have a feeling that tonight, Rob Van Dam is going to be smoking a big cigar. This may be RVD's night. Shawn Michaels for the last time, but he came back at SummerSlam, not the wrestle, but the fight. And then at Survivor Series eight days ago, he won the World Heavyweight Championship in the first ever Elimination Chamber. You know, I guess the Heartbreak Kid is really the comeback kid. I thought it was impossible, but he did it. This is Shawn Michaels' first title defense since winning the World Heavyweight Championship at Survivor Series. Yeah, this match should include Chris Jericho, and it would have if it wasn't for Scott Steiner. I thought you'd bring that up. You've become one big Chris Jericho butt kisser, I gotta <laughs> tell you. What? And let me cool this. Venga, se pues, vamos a defender el título. Vamos a hacer ropa en Damme. Oh, mira, vamos a hacer ropa en Damme. Entonces sí va a ser la noche de Van Damme. Oh. Me gusta porque sube muy rápido, pero de aquí que da la vuelta, te tarda mucho, mira. Oh. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our third championship match of the evening. Earlier tonight, Chris Jericho and Christian defeated the Dudleys to retain the World Tag Team titles, followed by Victoria successfully retaining her Women's Championship against Trish Stratus. And of course, Victoria defeated Trish to claim the Women's Championship just eight oh, days wait. ago at Survivor Series. Oh. Ah! oh man, how impressive was that? See that, Cole? Talk about getting your spine adjusted. Jeez. Ouch! And Michaels has that far away look in his eye. Well, I have to admit, this is a match I never thought I'd see, ever. It's a dream match, King. It's almost like a fantasy. I don't think anybody ever thought they'd see Shawn Michaels versus Rob Van Dam in 2002. Yeah, I, like many others, just assumed March 1998 marked the end of Shawn Michaels' story career. I guess you can never count HBK out. We talk a lot about Rob Van Dam's educated feet, but let's not forget Shawn Michaels has educated feet of his own with his sweet chin music. And that move has stopped some of the biggest names in our okay, industry. Okay, vamos, vamos. Including Red Hart, Chris Jericho and Triple H. Rob Van Dam won a triple threat match here live last week to become the number one contender for the World Heavyweight Championship. And Booker T and Chris Jericho were the other two men in that match. Oh, no me can't forget, Christian and Scott Steiner interjected themselves into the match. It was pure chaos. But when the smoke cleared, it was Rob Van Dam who walked away with tonight's title opportunity. What a move! Ah, me recordó al final del, del Jax.
¿Cómo se llamaba este? Barraca. Keino, Keino. Se llamaba Keino en casi ese modo fatality. No, I don't know how much long. Gol, pum. Star Fox flash to the back of Shawn Michaels. Can Van Dam capitalize? All he's got to do is turn HBK over, and this should be it. Here we go. Van Dam into the cover, hooks the leg. Who the hey? Triple H. What's Triple the H is here. Look out! Ruining this title match with a pedigree to Van Dam. Pero por qué? Yeah, but you gotta know, this is not about Rob Van Dam. This is the vindictive Triple H going against Ho, oh, going after Shawn Michaels. Yeah, Triple H that has been obsessed with the heartbreak kid. Oh, now wait a minute, put that down. What? Oh, this is not gonna be good. The game with that steel chair in the ring. And look at the way he's eyeing Shawn Michaels. He despises Shawn Michaels. He will not stop at anything until he ends Shawn Michaels' career. Shawn is down and out here. Oh, wait! Cuál? Órale. Órale. Órale, un combat. Órale. Ahí va. Tum. Se agarran bien sabroso entre los dos. He's got the heart, he's got the guts, he's got the soul of a champion. Esto está más emocionante que la pelea en sí. Just will not quit, but wait a minute. Oh, right, right through the chair. Oh. Uy, al final de todos modos le pegó con la, con la silla. ¿Cómo le hizo? Entonces ahora supongo que Rob va a querer la venganza. Ten, 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 ten. A centrada para ser árbitro. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your special guest referee, the world heavyweight champion, the heartbreak kid, Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels involved in a great world heavyweight title defense against Rob Van Dam here last week before it was interrupted by Triple H. But Michaels will be at Armageddon in less than two weeks in Fort Lauderdale, Florida on pay-per-view. Yeah, but who will he face? Will it be Rob Van Dam or Triple H? Voy a quitar esa entrada. A menos que digan algo los comentaristas. Aunque creo que ya todo está dicho, ¿no? Están luchando por un lugar para enfrentarse a Shawn Michaels contra en el Armageddon. Vamos a ver qué pedazo. ¿Qué pacho? ¿Qué pacho? Piggyback. I didn't think Shawn Michaels would ever return to WWE. But he came back at SummerSlam and beat Triple H in a street fight. Yeah. I never thought Shawn Michaels would get in the Elimination Chamber and fight for the World Heavyweight title, but he did. And I didn't think he could win it, but he believed he would become World Heavyweight Champion. Well, what's your point, Cole? Shawn Michaels has overcome so much, not just to return to the ring, but to become World Heavyweight Champion. And Rob Van Dam is in control. Ya me agarró, ya me agarró. This past Thursday in New York City, WWE superstars took part in the famed Thanksgiving Day Parade. 
Among those on the WWE float were Mr. McMahon, Sergeant Slaughter, Está bien enojado and the conmigo, man in the ring right no now, Triple H. Oh, sports entertainment has such a rich history with the Thanksgiving holiday. Of course, the first several Survivor Series pay-per-views took place on Thanksgiving. You were on the float once. I know. And let's not forget the rivalry between Harley Race and the, the company lado. Triple H in the ring tonight. Ric Flair reached its climax at Starcade on Thanksgiving night in 1983. Oh, I'll never forget it. So many all-time greats were on that card. Triple H with a cover on Rob Van Dam, and there's Shawn Michaels, and oh man, Triple H is not going to like that, Kay. You think that was a little slow? You think? <laughs> la cara de que quieres que haga? Así cuento. And now Rob hey, Van Dam is rolling up Triple H, and Whoa! oh! <laughs> a really fast count from Shawn Michaels now. Ah, me encantan esos shows de, la, de las luchas. Well, you gotta hand it to Shawn Michaels. He's not exactly an impartial referee in this one, is he? Just trying sí, to get no rey imparcial. Un rey, eh? un referee imparcial aquí. Big elbow. The game avoids trouble there. Yeah, Triple H saw that one coming a mile away. Triple H knows how to polish off an opponent. After what Triple H and Shawn Michaels have been through over the years, I'm still in shock that they have become such bitter enemies today. Well, it's hard to believe, King, as the founding fathers of D-Generation X, these two were nearly inseparable. Well, the Rose came off the DX Bloom almost immediately after Shawn Michaels lost the WWE Championship to Stone Cold Steve Austin at WrestleMania 14. Well, you're right, King, of course. Triple H claims Michaels dropped the ball that night at WrestleMania. The game me deja golpearlo, me deja golpearlo. X -Pac, Road Dog and Billy Gunn and without Shawn Michaels. Right. Man, this rivalry between Triple H and Shawn Michaels goes well beyond wins and losses. The game is hell bent on making HBK's life a living hell. And ironically, right, before this match started, Michaels told Triple H that as long as he has the World Heavyweight Championship, it's the game's life that will be a living hell. Well, it's hard to argue that. Triple Orale, H wins for the World Heavyweight Championship with every yeah, of his being, he wants nothing more than to recapture the gold. He saw that one coming. The animosity between Triple H and Shawn Michaels is well documented. No, 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 no. Was also the Capitador. Match that Shawn Michaels won at Survivor Series. Could there be any lingering animosity? Illegal, referee, it's illegal. HBK here tonight, King. I don't think so, Cole. Unfortunately for Rob Van Dam, he was eliminated from the match by the time Michaels entered. If there's any animosity on RBD's part, it would just be sour grapes. You hear how his leg connected? Lucete, lucete. Ah. Oh! Rob Van Dam with the offense. Great offense by Rob Van Dam. And a terrific reversal by Triple H. What a I don't know how Shawn Michaels is going to be impartial here tonight after what Triple H did to him last week with that backbreaker. Oh, the steel chair. Oh, there's a reversal. He whips Triple H into the corner. What's RVD going to do here? Oh, big shoulder oh, block. Right to the gut. Oh. Look at this. Oh, Triple H with the close on. Whoa, they both ducked. And now RVD off the ropes onto HBK. Ooh, a jumping corner splash. Now what? Straight right by Triple H. Triple H setting up something big. Pedigree, that's got to be it. You know, it wouldn't surprise me if Eric Bischoff came out here and stripped no, Shawn no, 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 no. the World Heavyweight Championship right now. Oh, come on, King. Why in the world would you say that? What? Michaels hasn't done anything to warrant that happening. Bad Appreciating Cole, this is as one-sided as it gets. Michaels is obviously for Rob Van Dam. Oh man, did you hear that? Rob Van Dam looking to capitalize. And he gets back in the ring. And that one hurt his hand. How is he still on his feet? RVD avoiding. Oh! Triple H tried to ruin a man's life. 
He attacked Shawn Michaels with a sledgehammer. He tried to put him in a wheelchair. Look, forget about all those things that happened in the past. Let's talk about tonight. We have a great match going on in the ring. Please, King, are you telling... Oh! King, did you see that? Oh, man, it doesn't get much closer than that. Déjame golpearte con la silla. Oh! Great move off the top rope. To take a chance like that. Do you know how badly he must want to win this? Oh, trying to put it. Wow, what a move from Triple H. That's how you sweep an opponent under the carpet. Two. Triple H knows how to polish off an opponent. No, 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 He anticipated that move perfectly. Rob Van Dam better shake out the cobwebs. Into the cover, hooks the leg. Two. Rob Van Dam still able to hang in this match. Kicks out. Pedigree, pedigree. The game's going to do it. That should do it right there. Two. Three. Oh, no. Come on. Shawn Michaels reluctantly counting the one, two. Three. Ting, ting, ting. No lo volvemos con la silla porque no me dio mucho tiempo, no me dejó. Hate that, but the game shoving it right in Michaels' face. One, two, three, and now what? <laughs> oh, look at this. Triple H demanding that Shawn Michaels raise the game hand in victory. Se mira bien guapo Shawn Michaels. He pro and do it. Oh! No, he isn't! <laughs> Michaels unloaded on Triple H and Triple H turned to the table. And another brawl is broken out between these two. Oh my gosh, the fists are flying. The game and Shawn Michaels going at it. Emotions running so high between these two men. They can't oh. stand each other. Wow. This has become so personal each and every week. All they got here. No! Oh. Big elbow off the rope and oh, the showstopper back to his feet. And finally, some help out here. Yeah, oh, Boom! Sweet chick music! Sweet chick music. Well, Triple H may have won this match, but he sure didn't win the fight. No me puedes ver. Ah, no, verdad, ese es otro. Lo dejamos hasta aquí. Yo fue el otro. Si no, lo voy a dejar hasta aquí. Tú les haya gustado. Y ya. El próximo Armageddon. The King of Kings. The Heartbreak Kid.